Hi everybody and welcome to Budget with Tiffany. I'm Tiffany. I'm so excited to have you here today. I'm going to be doing my first, I think it's first, cash on stuffing for the month of September. So let's jump right in. So up first we'll look at my variable expense binder and start with groceries. So we spent $22 at Target, so 22 And then we spent $57 at Aldi, so 55 57 And then we did $2 at Target and $6 at the co-op, and I'll just Combine them together for $8 and I've got 50 left. So we'll take back 20, 30, 42. My food, I ended up getting sushi yesterday and um, I think it was Elaine's live on Wednesday night. Um, several people were talking about food and several people mentioned sushi and so it kind of sounded really good so on Thursday I decided to go get sushi for lunch so that was ten dollars so I've got five dollars left so basically everybody that was in that live was bad influence on me but that's all right it was really good um, and then our only other thing in here was toiletries I got some deodorant for my husband and that was $7, so I'll put it, take out 10 and put back three. So we got 20, 42, 44, 45, 46. Okay. And then in our pet binder, litter so and that would end up being $19 it was not on sale this time so take out 20 put back a one so now we've got $21 and that is it for this binder and then only other expense was my husband his uh, the class that he's taking uh, to get this like coaching minor um, started right after Labor Day and so we had to pay um, the tuition and then unbeknownst to us apparently since it's the last class he has to take and what kind of quote unquote graduate um, he had to pay like an extra fee that we didn't know about that ended up being a few hundred dollars extra which kind of BS but whatever um, so we hadn't saved up for that but that's all right um so let's see so we have so it was 2201 and we had 1015 16 17 18 hundred or yeah 1800 55 57 59 Take that out of the education envelope and now that that class is done I'm going to take that out of here because he's not planning on taking any more courses and then since his coaching envelope was so high um, we decided just to take out the extra $342 from here I'm going to leave the donut ones because if you know you know so 100 200 300 And then I'll we'll take fifty dollars, so minus three fifty, so we should get back eight. So we have one hundred, two hundred, two fifty, two seventy, 
75, 77, 78. So 278 dollars remaining in coaching, which we talked about it, and he said, yeah, now that the the kids that graduated from his uh, from track that he coached, now that they're all off and scattered to the wind, they weren't going to end up doing a dinner, it just didn't end up working out. Um, and for football, he doesn't really buy stuff a whole lot to take in. Um, really, that really came up when he ended up coaching wrestling for like eight, one season. Um, and he was bringing in snacks and stuff for the kids for each of the meets. Um, and, but for track and for football, he doesn't really bring in much during like to the games and stuff. So it's really about saving up to take his kids out to dinner that are graduating. And so, so yeah, so let me take out $70 that I put in here for making change. And our total should be $2,324. Okay, so we got 1,000, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 2,000, 21, 22, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85, 95, 2,300, 5, <clears throat> 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So 2,324 dollars. Um, so yay, worked out. Always happy when that happens. I know I just watched a video of Elaine doing her first cash on stuffing and she was struggling a little bit. Um, and she kept commenting on how well I do with mine. And I, one, have been doing it several or you know, long enough that I feel like I kind of have a rhythm with it. Um, and I think also because I do it every week, I don't have that many, um, transaction and transactions in any given week so the fewer transactions you have I think the easier it is to do um and but yeah I just kind of create a system that works for me Hi started highlighting the categories so that I know which binder it comes out of um and then yeah I don't know just I, f I feel like the first few I did, I struggled, and there's been times where I've been wrong and um, and had to figure things out. So um, she'll get better at it as the more often she does it. But um, yeah, we've all been there. We've all made mistakes and and stuff. So, but yeah, so that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.